Nvidia are competing for the top spot in the GPU market. Both of these hardware have their own strengths and weaknesses so we are putting both together side by side to see which one has the edge over the other in terms of performance and features. Let's check out the video to unveil all the details. AMD vs NVIDIA What's the difference? AMD and NVIDIA are the two biggest graphics card manufacturers, and they've been locked in an ongoing battle for GPU supremacy that has resulted in a wide selection of new processors on the market that cater to various consumer preferences, performance levels, and budgets. While there's not much to separate their top-of-the-line products, AMD budget cards offer strong value at an affordable price. At the mid-range level, the AMD VS NVIDIA graphics card comparison is difficult there's little to separate the two manufacturers. Regardless of whether you buy an AMD GPU or NVIDIA, you will get a powerful GPU with plenty of functionality. AMD VS NVIDIA GPU Adaptive Sync As in other areas, AMD and NVIDIA are pretty much neck and neck when it comes to Adaptive Sync the ability to dynamically adjust the display refresh rate to match the GPU frame output. NVIDIA's G-Sync feature offers slightly better absolute performance, while AMD Free Sync tool is generally better value for your money. Testing has shown that NVIDIA's Adaptive Sync technology is able to achieve lower latency and higher quality output. But to achieve the best results, an NVIDIA GPU like the RTX 3060 Ti needs to be paired with a compatible monitor. This locks you into the combined price of the graphics card and monitor, and it means you can't mix and match for the sake of your budget. AMD Free Sync lowers response times, but it can lead to ghosting. The differences between G-Sync and FreeSync are small, and because FreeSync compatible hardware is more affordable, opting for NVIDIA's G-Sync can mean paying a lot more for only a small increase in performance. NVIDIA's G-Sync is still the gamer's favorite due to its unbeatable raw performance, but among AMD other budget and compatibility advantages, its FreeSync feature is also supported on current generation Xbox and PlayStation consoles. AMD GPU vs NVIDIA Laptop Performance When it comes to GPU design for laptops, NVIDIA is the clear market leader thanks to its ability to produce thinner, higher performance cards at competitive prices. For this reason, most laptops come equipped with an NVIDIA GPU. While you can get laptops with a Radeon RX 6800 or another AMD card, you're more likely to find one with an NVIDIA GPU such as the 1650 GTX 3080 Ti or 6800 XT. Apple is in the process of transitioning their full lineup of MacBook products to Apple Silicon graphics hardware, but some legacy models are still equipped with third-party GPU. Find out what graphics card your Mac has, and see if it can handle certain games by testing your MacBook's performance. AMD vs NVIDIA Which GPU is better? In terms of sheer state-of-the-art gaming luxury, NVIDIA's RTX 2080 Ti is probably the best, but the card that's right for you is just as likely to be AMD or NVIDIA. You might decide to forego Ultra HD or 4K definition, and use the money you save to try out a slew of new games you're interested in. Or maybe you want to get the highest clock speed possible within a certain budget ceiling. It's hard to say whether NVIDIA is better than AMD, because both brands have much to offer depending on your budget and performance needs. Both AMD and NVIDIA's top-end cards achieve similar performance results, but the winner isn't necessarily the one with the best benchmark scores. You need to find a GPU that delivers the user experience you need, with the right balance between price and performance. Alternatively, you might pick a specific NVIDIA or AMD GPU based on how well it runs your favorite games. Comparing two strong competitors is not just an easy task. However, we've done a little but choose according to your preferences. This video is just to help over the topic. Hope this video helped you out. Thanks for watching till the end.